As soon as I get into the ring and that bell rang, I felt so light, like, you know? Mm. And like, when I'm walking through the ring, I'm still making like prayers. I'm like, God, please help me. Like, you know? I, was, I was like, I'm on, I felt so unstoppable but because mm. of the training that I done. It was just like, there's no way I'm losing. I don't care who you put in front of me. Put in front of me, I'm gonna destroy them. And if you saw the fights, some of the fights, I wasn't technically better than the opponents. Yeah. It was just, I wanted it more. And they're like, I was just pushing, especially the finals. Yeah, yeah. Well, you, 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 earlier you mentioned uh, a dream you had before uh, before your fight on Friday. Yeah. Do you, can you share it with so, us? Yeah, so this, this, this is amazing. Final uh, on Friday was my finals when I was fighting the Cuban uh, Yesenia Toledo, mm -hmm. and uh, and you know the bus, the, the fights were in Oshawa and we were downtown staying. The, the village was downtown Toronto, and um, so I was sleeping and I had my alarm set and I was thinking, you know what? Maybe I won't go into the mosque today because you know I'm fighting today. It's for, it's, for Juma. It's, yeah, for Juma, and you know. You need to go, you know, mosque is more, is more, is more serious than boxing than everything else, yeah. you know, faith for me is more serious. And I'm sleeping and I'm thinking like, before I went to sleep, I'm thinking, should I go, should I not go? I'm so tired, like, you know, but I'm okay, I'll go to sleep. I took a nap and when I was sleeping, I hear the Adan, like, you know? In your dream? In my dream. And then my alarm goes off, like, it's time to wake up and I'm like, Okay, I saw the dream, like I have to go now. Like I have no excuse, like, you know? Yeah. And it was 34 degrees, like 35 degrees hot that day. Mm. And it was 20 minute walk to go to, go to the mosque. So I'm in the heat walking to the mosque, you know, and it takes a lot of energy out of you yeah. sitting there, you're listening, you know, 45 minutes, then I gotta come back 20 minute walk. So I spent about an hour and a half. I come back, I'm tired, and in two hours, we gotta leave. We gotta take the bus right. to Oshawa. It's That's like it. an hour drive. Way in, fights. And I'm on my way to Oshawa. I'm trying to catch a nap because, like, I'm tired. And then I didn't get a nap. We got to the venue. I'm warming up, and I feel so heavy. My arms, my everything is heavy. I'm like, what's going on, man? Mm. This is not good. <laughs> like, yeah, no, give me strength, like, you know? And then I'm walking into the ring. I'm still feeling heavy, like, like, you know, I'm heavy and I don't was know what's it, going on. Was like, it nerves? It wasn't nerves. It was just, I guess it was rest and two fights that I had. Everything was like so tense. And of course, probably the nerves too, because it's the finals and I'm trying to win. Like, you know, so it's so important. And you're, for and you're me. facing Cuba too. Yeah. And like, I'm getting in, I'm still feeling heavy. And as soon as I get into the ring and that bell rang, I felt so light, like, you know? Mm. And like when I'm walking through the ring, I'm still making like prayers. I'm like, God, please help me. Like, you know, what's yeah, going on? You know, I want, I want to the mosque, you know, I pray, <laughs> like, no, come on, brother. Like, like yeah, like, give me strength. Like, you know, I'm making dicker, like, you know? And then subhanAllah, like when the bell rang, like I felt so strong. And then, I don't know if you saw the fight, but I dropped the first round, they just didn't count it. They didn't mm. count it as an after. But Alhamdulillah, I got the win. Alhamdulillah. And, and it was a great, great experience. Wow. Man, that was that's a hell of a story. Yeah, Arthur, fun. thank you so much for coming on the show, brother. Thank you for, for having I me. I appreciate your time, brother. Thank you. If this was a good investment of your time, uh, remember to uh, remember to subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> if this was a good investment of your time, make sure to smash the subscribe button, check out my Patreon, follow my man Arthur Biaslanov, or I'll knock you out. <laughs> <laughs> I, I knew I was going to miss up somewhere. <laughs>